Hi, everybody. Dan and company. We're doing office hours at Agoric, and we got some questions on swing set. Um, and, you know, what's going on with the messages in our system? And we want to look at this. There's a thing called Causeway. Um, uh, Cosmo Visor, we talked about that earlier. Um, okay, so there's a pull request of mine from a long time ago that's kind of in the background. Here we are. So Causeway is a, a one of these time tra time traveling debuggers from quite a while ago. Um, let me see if I can just find that. Uh, introduction to Causeway. Distributed debugger. There's supposed to be a video in here somewhere or some pictures anyway. Um, oh, look at that. Sort of still runs. Um, um, yeah. <laughs> so this is one of their examples. Um, uh, I'll try to get a better high, high, uh, overview. Here we go. Come on. Right. Um, so the idea is you have all these vats running all over the place, and you're like, what's going on? <laughs> yeah, 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 eternal question. <laughs> so um, the messages get what this does is it instruments the calls between VATs um, and then it allows you to see how you got to any particular place, you know, any particular call, mm -hmm. what was the cause of it. Um, and they guess, I guess they do visualizations like this. Um, so you can have, I guess this is guys like, it's not exactly this example, but there's the example of, you know, buying mm -hmm. a plane ticket and, and getting a, uh, hotel and you know certain parts of that can go in parallel but then they have to join up and stuff like that um so this is the history of it, it kind of goes back i don't know when was you know it's probably in the 90s or something like that so um then i tried to convert slog files into the format that this tool eats mm -hmm, mm -hmm. i had some luck with that um here Mm -hmm. um, where's the actual code? Let's be here. Um, let's see. What was the last question you asked? Uh, what uh, what tool? Uh you're using the output for or how how can you visualize it in right right okay so um uh, text with it i mean i was just looking only on, on the text representation of it right um so this picture has got th these calls and it's saying that, okay, this is a call to kernel object 31 and the method is get sharing service. And this says that the arguments are that long. <laughs> mm -hmm. It doesn't actually tell you what the arguments are, yeah. um, but in some cases they're very large. So this is saying basic, I think kernel object 45 is probably Zoe. Zoe install a whole bunch of stuff, Yeah, you know, a bundle. Um, so, but this doesn't tell you, um, Another thing that's on this arrow is, and by the way, when you're done, here's the kernel promise for which, please give me the answer, mm -hmm. right? Because mm -hmm. uh, then you'll see this kernel promise fulfilled. Yeah, that's what actually allows you to say, oh, that that installation turned out to be, you know, and then whatever gets fulfilled at kernel promise blah 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 is the result of this call. Exactly. Mm -hmm. That would be the installation, um, and so that is where this. I was I was doing it this so call is in this diagram right now, but not the arrow in the kernel promise. So this would allow you to say, oh, this call is going to get resolved with that. And then you would look at 
this later in the diagram and say, oh, okay, that's how it got, you know, that was the answer to that. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. So that's, that's a, a, I guess sometimes I, I had it shown in this diagram and sometimes not because it got too busy or whatever. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah, I I kind of I kind of figured that um, the, the it, it it goes together in this way like what was uh, what was uh, called and uh, what was sent okay. back. Uh, I was just wondering if if there is a tool I can actually use it for the visualization that you that, that you showed us uh, right. so, previously. Um, so so I will take a look at that probably as well because it 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 looked cool. <laughs> yeah, where is it? right. So um yeah, on good days, you know, this thing allows you to look at mm -hmm, mm -hmm. all of the things that are going on and how they relate. And, how, you know, the, the different colors are for different vats, I believe. And so this mm -hmm. is basically this vat was calling that vat. Yep. And when you click on it, you get things like... Um, Uh, they actually have the whole stack trace and stuff. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, so if you click, what is this? Hmm. Maybe I don't. I don't see the stack trace information. So it would actually show you the the, the source file and the line in this in the source code where where the call happened and stuff. What is this telling us? I can't read this anymore. <laughs> I want yeah, to know yeah. how this worked. Um, there's also a video somewhere in the Causeway world that is good for orientation. Um... So the output file should be just input for the for the Causeway tool. Correct. Right. And That's it, what I it, was... it, and, and, and that should work. Okay. There it is. Mainstream model for distributed health. Right. Okay. So, um, as usual, I'll give all these links. Um, but uh, yeah, so this is the a good in, you know four and a half minutes to tell you which awesome. ended up. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah, yeah. I just I just needed needed a pointer. Right. I think I'll 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 manage the rest. Thing. Thank you very much. Yes. If you manage to get more of that working, you, you would get many cheers from the dev team. <laughs> <laughs> all right all right well yeah if you if you're looking into the slack file long enough <laughs> you'll you, you'll start seeing things right, right. The, the question is if, if they are real or not <laughs> i sometimes doubt it <laughs> yeah um yeah i was doing in our incentivized test net i was loading them into like pandas and doing visualizations that way and Google big data and I was doing all kinds of weird stuff with them. Um, yeah, I would like to. I would like to actually later see uh, uh, a testnet or devnet log file if it if it were at all possible. Uh, I mean, I think Nick told me that I am I I can ask for that, but I have never done that so far. Right. Um... I figured it. I figured it would be way too confusing to start with, so I was just. We must have them around, but yeah. Um, uh, yeah, that's, that's that's okay. I'll 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 let him know and ask him if right. if it's if it's possible, if it's okay, and we'll see. Yeah. 